The song is inspired by Michelle by The Beatles for their line cliche. I've been trying to write a melody with it, or with the line cliche for forever, and I finally did it. And also Mass Effect, because Tally. All right, so I didn't record myself making the melody because usually those take me like dead ass hours, but I really started with the root notes. Originally I did C sharp, but then I moved it up a semitone because yeah, it sounded better. And I didn't realize this at the time, but the um, but the key that I was at originally, it was um, it was the key of Michelle. To mix this, I'm just using Maximus, EQ, Reverb. For the electric piano part, um, I'm just putting a phaser and double delay. I then decided to just create some variation with the melody by just doing this little neat trick that I really like doing. It's with these really long notes, or not notes, chords, I just pitch it down like around like halfway through the thing. I just pitch it down a whole octave and turn down the velocity and it sounds great. Using Rocco Barata's Psychic Purity Pack because it's just amazing. <laughs> came back after some time and I decided to just change my background and it just fit the song perfectly. This really became like the centerpiece of what I based like the mood off of, you know? At this point, I'm just leveling out everything, making sure everything's in the right place, EQing, mixing everything together. And now I'm gonna add like a vox, not a vocal, but a vox lead that kind of defines the high space, not the high space, but the high frequencies. For the Cyberbox lead, I changed a few things with it to fit this one specifically, but in reality, it's really just a radio filter, bit crushing, and reverse reverb. Now onto the strings. I really wanted to make some like fairy tale lullaby shit. And what I'd end up doing is doubling the strings, panning one to the left and to the right to give it some space. I wanted to go up and down and then go up uh, another octave.
All right, so now I'm doing the lead. I decided to turn on my keyboard on and just do the lead from there. And this is usually something I do. Usually I just go up and down an octave and just see what I can do from there. All right, so with the mix, I'd add a delay, harmonic reveal so that it's vibrant, not distorted. And then a basic noise gate that goes left and right, alternate panning that goes on and off during the song. Building the vocal chain, using a limiter to equalize everything out, auto-tune, compressor to keep the transients in, dynamic EQ, de -esser. deep chorus for stereo width and depth, sound good as I with vocal splitter, reverb, and surge XT delay, which I really like because it lets you control the, the left and right delay timing individually. So I'm just following the root notes, just trying to keep it groovy and something that you can dance to. I'm going to be using the West Road 808. I don't know where it's from, but it's really good. And I'm also going to double this 808 so I can turn it into another bass. The drums, I like to really be in control with it, mess around with the velocities and the panning. I also enable it swing so I can control the groove a little bit, just have it really natural sounding. I'd end up doing what I usually do with my rims. I put some bit crush, some panning on it, and compressor, and yeah.
this is pretty optional and usually a thing that I do. I don't really hear it a lot. I mean, I do, but you know. So I really add, like to add a lot of vox just so it, there is like an enunciation and it's not just drums that are a part of, I guess, the drum bus. And it's just also, you know, vox. I thought maybe there was a chance for peace. So why help them? They're still my people, even if I am the Admiral's dirty little secret. And what about us? Am I your dirty little secret? Or... I thought you'd support the invasion. No, after... And what about us? Am I your dirty little servant? And what about us? Am I your dirty little servant? Dirty little secret. No, their disapproval can't be any worse than being exiled. But right now, I've got civilian ships taking fire. Can we keep this quiet, at least in front of the admirals? Sure thing, Miss Vas Normandy. Oh, thank you. If you want to talk in private, maybe you could invite me up to your cabin? Maybe I could. <laughs> 